Christmas is almost here guys. Now I say when manza kwenda nyumbani, sio you na plan gani kuhusu Christmas? Please let us know what you're planning this Christmas. Hapa Grapevine we are concluding the shows. Ndio za mwisho mwisho is kwa hivyo you better enjoy yourselves, eh? Yes guys, and you know we always save the best for last. And tonight on the show, we celebrate a colorful festival and a young female entrepreneur who's beat all odds to remain very high up like the first actually the top artist yes. one of the top artists in the industry right here in the 254 so guys i'm your host sally need to say alam abinguma and this right here is most definitely great boy what you got to do in the spirit of celebrating this wonderful season abi mm. tell me what do you like doing <laughs> <laughs> during this I mean December, I can't say me December. Sindi <laughs> 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 me holiday. Mm-hmm. Mwanzo kabisa last year si the same na this year kwangu. Mm-hmm. Yes, so probably this year nitachoma nyama kidogo pale, okay. najua na bibi apike chakula pale tukule. Najialika. Karibu sana. <laughs> Karibu sana. Na unapenda kwa nini? Na penda kukula. Umesema food, unachoma <laughs> nyama. That is me right there. 25th. I'm your family. I'm coming through. Ah, karibu sana. <laughs> so guys, um as we enter the festive season, we are to encourage you to be responsible mm-hmm. na kuwa careful in whatever they do. Kama una enjoy kanywaji kidogo pale, do not drink and drive. And in the spirit of that and to pass the message along to the youth through fun and of course music, there was a festival that did just that this beginning of this month. Yes. And it was dubbed Color Fest. Check it out. No yo. Over the past few years, statistics have shown that young people bear the brunt of HIV infection in Kenya. To this end, led by a team of young tasks, Maisha Youth, Colorfest was this time round tailor-made to address this and other issues. So we it's good because we are remembering. You know Kitambo people with AIDS living with AIDS walikuwa wametengwa. They were like you know if you have AIDS you you're a bad man how far utakikani kwa society but with such events like this huh, at least they wanajua it's it's just a disease like any other. The event attracted just the right ages sold as a young adolescence and healthy fun day out that also doubled as a colorful musical day. By using the language young people understand the best, entertainment and music, Color Festival was out to cover more serious and pertinent areas that haven't been too colorful among the youth. I think it's a good day for people to to know about AIDS and it's real. You definitely need to know your status. I know my status. <laughs> First what is shocking is the new statistics like per hour of two young people are getting infected like in one hour between the ages of 15 to 24 they are getting infected so which means 48 people young people are getting infected daily in Kenya Going beyond HIV and AIDS, it focused on other issues deeply affecting young people and adolescents including stigma, mental health, drug and substance abuse, SGBV, contraceptives among others. Even as the hot bloods enjoying splashing color in the air, all these bore a heavy symbol and a sober commitment they were making. Each area of focus was celebrated at every hour with a color splash of a different color. Yellow was for stigma, pink mental health, orange was a splash for drug and substance abuse. while red was for SGBV, 
blue was finally for the prevention. They used to have fun and always be cautious. You know, youth, they appreciate very little things. But when you actually have a specific day dedicated to appreciating this and to creating awareness, I like it. As a strictly drug and alcohol free festival, the entertainment package was picked just right. <laughs> Throughout the day, besides a hype stage, HIV screening and counseling services ran concurrently. Of course. But what I tell people is to concentrate on creating awareness not just for you but also for the people that are with you because not everybody knows this I couldn't not every, I couldn't know what is right and what is wrong depending on when you so just keep telling other people to do the right thing and for you to lead in the right example kama we kama youth hapo hivyo mtaani hapo hivyo jiji unafaa tu uende ujue status yako ya aids juu any aids simtezo